So before I go into the relationship between business and children's rights, I need to talk to you about children's rights. The United Nations Conventions on Children's Rights provides children with 42 different kinds of rights. Some of these are very obvious. The right to education, the right to health care, some of them much less so. Businesses directly affect children's rights, not just in terms of child labor, for example, but also protecting children from harmful products, from harmful messaging, from also other basic rights, such as a right to a safe environment, pollution, um, displacement of you know, indigenous children from their areas. Does that sound familiar? Recently, the State of Children's Rights and Business Report, published by the Global Child Forum and BCG, looked at companies across 25 indicators that affect children. These were the top 10. Two major takeaways. IT, software and services scored lower than oil and gas and mining. How? So the report basically looks at content consumed on these sites, on streaming sites, the effects of social media on children, and also predatory behavior, exposure to bullying, and so on. The report particularly notes this concept of information nutrition being as important as child nutrition, which I found super interesting. So in these four impact areas, Marketplace particularly looks at the marketing and labeling of companies and how it's aimed towards children, uh, safety of products and services that's used by children, and the recognition of children's rights in, in the business assessments of companies. And that's the lowest. So the report explains this by saying that uh, children are exposed to marketing that's aimed at adults. Products that are meant for adults um, are unsafe for children, but that may not be mentioned. And that children are exposed to certain biases within marketing um, that's harmful for children. To be fair, though, the report mainly relies on company disclosure and reporting. But if they did rely on stakeholder reports and media, we know how much children's rights are actually looked at.